My name is Sandra Acosta. I'm a postdoctoral fellow here at the Center of Excellence for Aging and Brain Repair. My work is characterization of the brain in terms of inflammatory factors or inflammatory cells depending on the disease. And in this center, we studied different neurodegenerative diseases such as stroke, Parkinson's disease, Alzheimer's disease, ALS, different, different type of neurodegenerative diseases. We do something uh, very, uh, very interesting, which is counting cells in 3D, and it's called stereology. So I'm one of the experts here in stereology, so I go take the sample into the microscope, and we start counting cells in different areas of the brain. We have a stroke problem. We know it's ischemic attack in the brain, so we have that problem, so we need to solve it. So that's one of the things that I like the most, to plan the experiments to see what could work, what pharmaceuticals can we use to ameliorate you know, the disease process. I was born in Caracas, Venezuela. I wanted to be exactly a chemist. I didn't know that you, know, you could be, as a little girl, I didn't know that you could be more than that. So chemistry is very important. So I, all my games or anything that I asked to, for Christmas was uh, chemistry, toys, and chemistry formulas and, and things like that. I consider to be a medical doctor, but I realized that um, as a medical doctor, you can help people one by one. As a scientist, I think, you have the great opportunity to help millions of people at once. Well, everything we do on the bench in a laboratory can help millions. I came here when I was 19 years old, uh, not knowing uh, the language very well, so I have to take English courses. That was the very first challenge, but I think as everything is, is possible. I'm here. I was able to go on and do my master in physiology and pharmacology. I went ahead and did my, my doctorate in neuroscience and neurosurgery. This is a section of a stroke brain, and this is all the microglia that you can see. Microglia are inflammatory cells. Oh, there's a lot. Yeah, there's a... Uh... My goal is to leave a mark in terms of uh, molecular therapeutic and how can we really um, detain or stop the disease progress with, a, with either stem cells that can be anti-inflammatory or with a pharmaceutical agent or with a drug. For the young people that want to become a medical researcher, uh, I will say that work hard. Science is a, is a beautiful career. It's very important to get the right advice. I was lucky enough to get uh, very good counselors in high school and in college. And don't give up, don't be afraid of math. Have a very critical thinking. If you're one of those persons, you're, you're, you can be a, a scientist, a neuroscientist. <laughs>